individual. You know, again, positive thinking, and um, we all have those crazy dark places that we find ourselves in. And I'm an actor, so I have to access that stuff sometimes um, when working. It's kooky. It's dark and weird. And I, and I love it for what it's worth, but I'd love to take it and turn it into positivity. You have to. I mean, it's... And again, we were talking about this at the point yesterday, Bernie. The, the, this... I was talking to a quantum physicist. I'm not going to go into quantum theory with you guys, trust me. But because it's mind-boggling and it'll make us all feel goofy and dumb. Um, it does it to me. But the idea that this thing is so powerful, it is as powerful as any satellite beaming and shooting the signals that we're watching our televisions and movies on every day. And if you create positive thinking in here, guess what it does? It goes, and it projects out there. And you pick up on it, and I pick up on it. So, those days when it's raining and cold, well, it doesn't get cold here, but <laughs> when it's raining and it's just dreary or you're in a funk, you have to find this place of positive thinking because it's the only thing that's going to bring you out of it. And also, too, by the way, when's the last time you, you, you had a blast hanging out with someone that just does this all day? <laughs> it's not that fun. Someone who's positive and, you know, thinking and up and moving around and coming up with ideas, and that's, that's what we feed off of and that's what we love. So if there's any one rule that I would live by or that I do, never going to tell you what to do, it would probably be that. Good luck. <laughs>